case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2008, the United States Court of Appeals for the Federal Circuit heard the case of Computer Docking Station Corp. v. Dell Inc. The case centers on the notion that a patentee can limit the scope of their patent by clearly stating what their patent does and does not cover during the application process. Computer Docking Station Corporation, CDSC, filed a lawsuit against Dell, Gateway, Toshiba America, and Toshiba America Information Systems, alleging that their portable microprocessor systems infringed on CDSC's patent. The patent in question described a portable microprocessor system capable of connecting to peripheral devices through individual connectors or a docking connector. The defendants argued that their products did not infringe on the patent because their systems included built-in displays and keyboards, which the patent did not cover. The case went to the United States District Court for the Western District of Wisconsin, which ruled in favor of the defendants. The court determined that the patent did not apply to computers with built-in displays or keyboards. Additionally, the court found that the case was not exceptional and did not warrant attorney fees. The Court of Appeals upheld the district court's decision, agreeing that the defendant's laptops and docking stations did not infringe on CDSC's patent due to the inclusion of built-in displays and keyboards. Furthermore, the court supported the district court's denial of attorney fees and costs, as the case was not exceptional, and CDSC had conducted a reasonable pre-filing investigation and engaged in licensing discussions. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.